Hey gang, welcome to another episode of the show. Well, had a little bit of an incident last week. That's why there was no show last week, because I was going to take the shaker out of the hood scoop and paint it to match the car, but it was hanging above me, above my head in the rafters. Go ahead and point it up to the rafters. Yeah, the hood used to be hanging up there. Well, as you know and I know now, that, that was a bad idea. Somebody had pointed that out. I'm not going to say her name, but she's like I told you. But anyway, we'll get back. So, we put the hood back on the car. The hood is really dented. All the epoxy has been popped loose. So, we're going to try to pound this hood out in a future episode, maybe do some epoxy to maybe save this hood if we can. If not, just buy another one. But I'm still going to paint the shaker to match the hood, regardless. So, we're going to scuff this, mask this. We're going to mask it, then scuff it. Paint the vent area black, mask that off. And unfortunately, there's a lot of time left because this is a tedious operation. So, throw that beautiful time lapse. <laughs> That was very tedious. So now we just gotta wipe it down. I'm gonna give it a little rinse with some water, and then we're gonna break out the spray paint. So I'm sorry, but I gotta do this. More time lapse. <laughs> tape is still holding so I'm gonna hit it with this this isn't your average ordinary off-the-shelf rattle can this is a special mix I had done to match the heritage brown of the Trans Am it is code 3126 this is body shop quality but in an aerosol can so it's gonna take us a couple of coats to do this so gotta do it to you again more time left <laughs>
getting close to the same color as the car. Uh, uh, probably about five coats, maybe six. I lost count, somewhere between one and two. But it's getting close to the underside of the deck lid. Maybe one more coat, and this should be all right. And uh, hope you guys are enjoying watching paint dry, because I sure am. So let's tack that up and uh, let it dry a little bit more, and then we'll do one more final coat on there and see how that looks. All right, and that was the last coat. So we're gonna put this in the trunk, let it dry. That way no bugs or nothing land on it. I'm surprised nothing land on it so far today. We're gonna to put it in the trunk, let it cure the next week or the week after that, let this thing really cure and really dry. Then we'll peel all the stickers off and see how she looks. So, yeah. Hope you enjoyed watching paint dry. I surely did. So remember to like, subscribe, tell your friends, tell your friends, friends, tell your enemies, friends, and your friends as enemies. So until next time, thanks for watching.